Hey guys, guess what? So I'm gonna be going on a road trip for the next five days and we're gonna be going to five different states and I'll be vlogging my whole experience. We're also gonna be seeing some colleges with my family friends. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Okay, so these are the places that we're gonna be going to. So we're first gonna go to Washington DC and then we're gonna go to Charlottesville, Virginia and then Philadelphia and then New York. And then lastly, we're gonna go to Yale, which is in Connecticut. So currently it is Sunday, August 7th, and it is currently around 12.30, and we are about to go leave for our 10 hour road trip. Wish me luck on the road trip, and hopefully I don't get too bored. Look who it is, Justin. We are packing for the road trip. Okay, so if we don't stop, our arrival time is predicted to be at 8.17 p.m., and it's gonna take us seven hours and 15 minutes. McDonald's. What? This is unnecessarily long. Hey, hey. These are so good here. Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. So it is now like 8.15 and we've been on the road for so long. We stopped three times to go to three different McDonald's and now we're on our final stretch. We have like an hour and 45 minutes left and here are the states that we've passed so far connecticut new jersey new york pennsylvania and maryland now and here's justin wow it's so pretty guys we made it we're at the hotel now so we got here at around 10 o'clock allison's here <laughs> smile breakfast and then and it's super nice I love to see feels good we're at the gift store right now lunch now at Panic Farmer yeah so then we walked to lunch and it was pretty good I ordered some ravioli there so we're at Georgetown right now so we just got back from eating lunch and then we took two different Ubers to get here but we made it here and now we have like half an hour before the tour so we might go to shopping. We're at Georgetown right now and I ran into my friend Natalie. <laughs> the chances of this happening were really small. The Georgetown tour went good. I really liked the school and now we're just shopping and we're gonna about to have ice cream guys we're shopping on a street near georgetown and we just got cookies from insomnia cookies they're so good so good oh my god 10 out of 10. here are all the ice cream flavors looks so good looks so good so so good if you're in dc go to thomas sweet and get the vanilla chocolate chip washington monument now guys we made it to the washington monument it's so tall hey guys it's we're here. We're at the Washington Monument. So pretty and so sunny right now. So right now I'm with Allison and her mom and we're gonna go look for my mom and the guys. So then we sat by the Temperance Fountain and it was really relaxing and peaceful and there are also these adorable ducks in there and also like a bunch of other families. Guys, there. can we just talk about how pretty, like look and then look at behind me. Oh my gosh. Fountain and the Lincoln Memorial. It literally looks so peaceful over here next to the Lincoln Memorial. And look at the docks too. Okay, so update, everyone is really tired right now, except for me. They don't wanna go back to the hotel, but I want to go to the wharf and now no one wants to go. So we're gonna just go to dinner and then go back to the hotel again. So it is currently Tuesday and it's 11.25 and we just finished our American University tour. Austin, what are your opinions on the tour? It was okay. <laughs> We're all going to lunch now at Raccoon. Featuring some of the food. Okay, so my top three of yesterday were... Okay, so the first one was getting cookies and ice cream. The second one was our night swim. And then the last one was probably lunch. So for me, mine was definitely shopping, like getting ice cream and the cookies, and then our night swim, and I also liked our morning walk where we took pictures. 
And now we're at lunch and we just ordered a bunch of food and we'll show you guys that. The food came and the portions are huge. Like look at this. Basically we just ordered this and it just comes with all of these things. Even you. Ooh. Hi guys, Hi. we're in the car right now and we're on our way to the Tidal Bastion and then after we're going to the Are you sure I'm using Yay! Free right now in DC. Me and Justin got scooters. Hello. And now here we are at the Tidal Bastion. It's so pretty. Look how pretty the Tidal Bastion is. They have these really nice trees with the shade here and then that's the actual building and yeah. See the phone right now, but we're at the Hirschhorn Museum now. We're now at the Hirschhorn Museum. Oh. Is this the artwork that I'm sitting on? Yeah. <laughs> really? That's why it buzzed. We're having gelatos. Hey, so it's currently around like four and before the Hirschhorn Museum, we went to the Tidal Basin and me and Justin screwed around. Allison was a little scared of the scooters. <laughs> It was scary. Yes, um, but you have to get used to it. And then after that, it's good. Me And then we got pulled to the Hirschhorn Museum without Ben. It was a little bit of a letdown. Yeah, because we wanted to go to this place with lights, but apparently you had to get tickets. So guys, if you want to go, you must get tickets. Go in the morning to get claim your tickets. They're free. We're um, on our carpool road trip to Virginia from DC and we're stopping at a gas station. We're gonna go to the bathroom and I'm gonna change. Car trip has been good so far. Me and Allison have done some karaoke and then we cleaned out our camera rolls because I have a lot of things in my camera rolls with all the shorts and pictures and long videos. Hey, we got some high shoes. Road trip right now and look, it's a rainbow. So beautiful. It's huge. It, I can like see the whole thing. Although I don't, oh yeah, you can kind of see on video. Look at the whole thing, so pretty. Especially this part, it's like coming right out of the clouds. Oh. Arrived in Virginia. <laughs> and now we're at our hotel and it's literally like in a shopping plaza. So tomorrow morning, me and Allison will have a lot of places to travel to. It turns out we went to the Run Hotel. <laughs> so now we're gonna go find our hotel. Me and Allison are in the hotel room and we're about to check out the pool and then get dinner. Here's a hotel tour. So basically when you walk in, here is the suite living area room. By the way, this is the biggest hotel room I've ever stayed in. So this is so nice. We have the kitchen and we have fridge. And then, and when you go inside, then here's the actual bedroom area. We have the beds and then here's the mirror. Dinner now. I think I ate like 10 pieces of bread. It's dinner. Hotel. Currently at breakfast. It is Wednesday now and it's around 8:30. And after this, we're gonna pack up and then we're gonna go to our tour at UVA. It's my breakfast. And then Allison and Ben are currently getting breakfast. Um Allison just came back with this. This my bacons. So this was us on the UVA tour. The buildings are all so nice. Allison, how's it going? It's going great. It's just hot. It's really hot outside. However, our tour was 90 minutes and it just ended. Okay, so the UVA tour just finished and we're now the front tenda right now. Tiffany's walking around the rotunda. We stopped at Chick-fil-A to get some food. And we also got Panera Bread. Here's the Chick-fil-A. There's a cherry here, but I ate it. And oh here's God, our yeah. meal. Guys, this is actually my first time eating at Chick-fil-A. Currently on the road trip. Oh my God, look at these hills. Guys, it's raining so hard right now. Oh my. So you won't lose it? Road trip fun. Girl, someone is out. Oh my gosh, guys. Believe it or not, I'm actually at the exact same stop station that I was like a few years ago on my eighth grade DC trip. And I never thought that I would be in a place that I recognized because this is like 10 hours from home. Guys, we made it to Pennsylvania and here's our hotel. It is right in the U Penn campus and we're also next to a bookstore. And just look at the sunset over here. It's so gorgeous. You can barely see it, but I love it. As we were driving to our restaurant, we passed by the Liberty Bell, which was so exciting to see because it was literally right there. And the city of Philly is amazing. Dinner. 
Ice cream. Oh, so pretty. Here at Spruce Street Harbor Park. <laughs> I think it's a pineapple passion fruit drink refresher. Never had it before, but it's good. And a cake pop. I wanted the chocolate, but I got the cookies and cream. Oh, in the UPenn gift store. store. We just finished our UPenn tour. The school is really nice. It has good academics and yeah, good social life. Yeah. And now we are heading to our drive to New York. Hey guys, so right now we're on the car ride from Pennsylvania to New York. And look what we have. So. Of course, I had to make a stop at the Penn Buck store to get some snacks. So I got some goldfish and I also got some Welch's fruit snacks. Me and Allison right now are going to review our top three activities from the past two days. So on Tuesday, I would say my number one favorite activity was scootering at the Tile Basin with Justin. And then my second favorite thing was probably when we had dinner at the Italian restaurant. The service there was super good. And then my third favorite thing from the day was probably getting gelatos at the Hirsch Museum. Okay, so my first favorite thing of the day was getting the gelatos because they were so good. And then my second was maybe the drive to UVA because that was really fun. Oh yeah. And then the third was probably dinner at the Italian restaurant. Okay, then yesterday, which was Wednesday, my top three activities were, I think first I would say the drive to Pennsylvania. And then I would say second would probably be just walking around UVA. That was kind of fun. And then my third favorite activity would probably be getting lunch at Panera and Chick-fil-A. First favorite activity was probably ice cream. And then my second favorite activity was I mean, the breakfast at the hotel was actually really good. Yeah. So you gotta make your own waffles. Mm -hmm. And then the, my third favorite was probably dinner at the Chinese restaurant. Mm. Currently on the carpool ride. Wouldn't they want to keep the magic for themselves? We have arrived in New York. <laughs> Guys, we are approaching Times Square in New York. So excited to see this place. Guys, we're in New York right now at our hotel and here's our hotel. We're on the 11th floor and let's check out our view. Ooh, okay. We kind of have a city view right here. That's a good Times Square. Yay, and have dinner. New York is so pretty. I love New York's shop right now. H&M right now, that's literally 20 stores hot. <laughs> Times Square right now. <laughs> Tiffany is in New York City. We're on tap right now and it's approximately like 9.30. We're having a late dinner and we just finished shopping from Times Square. And I got an LA blue top and uh, a New York top. Yay. trip and it is around 9 a.m. so we just finished having breakfast and now we're gonna pack up and then head to a park and then our NYU tour. Our breakfast right now. So right now it is 10 and we are on our way to NYU. Okay so from yesterday I would say my top three favorite things were shopping at Times Square, eating at Black Tap, and my third favorite thing was probably going on the UPenn tour. NYU tour and we're heading to have ramen for lunch. Look how pretty this place is. 
So this is the bowl that I had. It was pretty good, I'd say. We're at the Museum of Ice Cream, Allison's favorite place. We're here. Oh guys, by the way, the NYU tour was good. It's really in the city. And then we went to go eat lunch at this ramen noodles place and I got a bowl of ramen noodles. And now we're at the Museum of Ice Cream. Okay, so here are some of the cool rooms there. First, we had this delicious pink vanilla ice cream with sprinkles. It was my favorite one there. We were served four more ice creams after this, by the way. And all the rooms were so aesthetic and so picture worthy. You should watch my vlog on it, like the shorts version. Yeah. That's the four of them. And then we passed by the Sour Patch store, so we had to go in and there were so many different flavors. And then we passed by Madison Square Garden. The Museum of Ice Cream was the best experience. And we also went to the Sour Patch factory and I got some Sour Patch. In Connecticut now, and look at the sunset. Oh. We are on our last road trip and this one is from New York to Connecticut because <laughs> we're gonna be driving by to see Yale. Yay. On this car trip, um, it has been two hours and we've obviously watched some jam and cleaned out my camera roll. I've also done a few other things, but yeah. Look at the sunset. Yale is a really pretty campus, especially at night. Last college of the trip. Ah, oh, Yale is beautiful. We're eating at the Yorkside Pizza and Restaurant right now for dinner. The food was so good and so warm. I ordered the pizza, which was good, but my favorite had to be the pasta. Oh, it's the last time. I'm so sad. <laughs> okay, my top three favorite things from this trip was definitely the ice cream museum, number two, shopping in New York, and number three, eating ice cream everywhere and so many cookies and all of that here at 3d no definitely ice cream museum then shopping and then the road trips were pretty fun i know that was so fun so sad